Very well. All right, talk about this uh, true service Very dogs good. here. You're looking at four legged companions. I think we have pictures actually from Freedom Service Dogs. Not just any dogs, but those who have changed the lives of our veterans. And joining us today is Brand Corporate Trainer or Training Manager for Freedom Service Dogs. Brand, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having us. And who's us. this? This is Layla. Hi, Layla. You've been sniffing all over the place. She is such <laughs> a sweetheart. All right, tell us about Freedom Service Dogs. I mean, tell us about so, the organization. Freedom Service Dogs is a nonprofit organization. We rescue dogs from shelters mm -hmm. and train them to be service dogs. So we've been in business for 25 years now. This is our 25th year, so we're pretty excited to have made it this far. Wow. Um, and we generally look for Labrador Retrievers, Golden Retrievers, and Standard Poodles. Since we get our dogs from shelters, they are mostly mixes of those breeds. I'm looking at some really <laughs> adorable pictures. Is that a Standard? I can't see that, that far. That is Gander. He oh. is... Um, a Labradoodle. Oh, nice. He's adorable. Very, very cute. There he is driving a Subaru. Okay, so you look for specific <laughs> dogs to train. Yes. Talk about the process of training these dogs. So it is a pretty intensive process. Um, we start out slowly with evaluations, kind of see if the dogs want to be service dogs. Sure. We want our dogs to enjoy being out in public with their people all the time. And if the dogs don't want to do that, then we release them from our training program and we put them into our adoption program. Um, we always say that our dogs got the golden ticket because we make sure that they get into a good place. So the dogs go through six to 12 months of training mm -hmm. in order to be service dogs. So once they are service dogs, how do you actually pair them up with the veterans in need and what, what kind of service do they provide? Sure. So lots of veterans come to us with PTSD or with physical disabilities or traumatic brain injuries. You can find our application on our website. Mm -hmm. It is a pretty intense application process. We want to make sure that a service dog can help you and that you'll be a good candidate to receive a service dog. There is a wait time, um, depending on your exact needs. And then we kind of, as our dogs become available, look through our waiting list and kind of try to match them up on needs and personality types. We want it to be a good fit. We kind of want there to sure. be some good chemistry between the dog and the client. Uh, for those who maybe want to be a part of Freedom Service Dogs, maybe they want to be a trainer like you. I mean, how can they even get started? Sure. Or volunteer? We are always looking for volunteers. There's okay. so many different things we use volunteers for. You can also find that information on our website. There's also an application for that. But we have a great volunteer program, and we have some great volunteers who really help us do what we do. That's awesome. And, and then the application process, the veterans just go online as well as far as what kind of dogs would be a good match or a good fit, right? Yep, when they come in, we kind of see what their likes and dislikes okay. are. Real quickly, we do have an event coming up for those yes. who want to take part. Maybe they'll get to you know meet you and Absolutely. other people at Freedom Service <laughs> in person. Talk about that. This is our Posh Pad Pups and Pino event. It'll mm -hmm. be held at the Four Seasons in downtown Denver. It is a cocktail um, from 6.30 to 8.30 p.m., we're going to tour one of their 37th floor $5 million residences. There will be a performance artist and a jazz band, hors d'oeuvres, cocktails. It is a big fundraiser to help us fund four dogs for four veterans for the 4th of July. All right. Those are some <laughs> pictures to kind of give you an idea of the environment, the setting. So go and join them if you want to show support. Again, the event is being held Tuesday, Tuesday. July 10th, right? Yep. At the Four Seasons Hotel in downtown Denver. For tickets and more information on Freedom Service Dogs, go to our website, thedenverchannel.com. We have a link there. Just click on that big red TV button. Thanks for being here. Thank you again for having us. We'll be right back.